These charges are grave. I'm bringing the proof with me to Voss, Emissary. When you see it, the three will banish the Empire from the planet. I'm afraid Jedi Master Keln is mistaken, Emissary Samaro. No such evidence can possibly exist. I am confident that the three will find that an alliance with the Empire can only benefit your people. I await this evidence. Insufferable idiot. Ah, you've arrived. It's about time. No doubt you've heard some of that. Things aren't going smoothly for the Empire here. Voss must be brought into the Empire. Their obstinance was a problem before the Jedi began meddling. We sense a great power here, strong in the dark side. These people have powers of prophecy we have never seen before. The Empire must have this world and its secrets, and we know from experience that it cannot be taken by force. So you've already attempted force? That incident has been smoothed over. We held enough executions to ensure that there are no further mishaps here. And now this Jedi Master appears and thinks he can sabotage all we've done. Shall I get rid of this Jedi? Your enthusiasm will serve the Empire well. A syndicate was hired to steal supplies from the city of Voskar. We then generously offered aid to the people in need. But the syndicate was made up of Hauk. Brutish idiots who turned from saboteurs into raiders. Maybe it's time to resort to violence. The Syndicate's lair is in a cave system. Silence these Hauk. Report to General Roche in Fort Codentha afterward. Come in, outsider. You seek the alien enclave. The way isn't always clear. Yanaton, tea for the guest. Which tea? All of them, until he finds one that suits him. I am Baston. This is my tea house. Forgive my daughter. We should start anew as the spring. You're very kind. Is there somewhere we can talk? When tea is ready, host the others. This man is a friend of a good friend. I will share his time. We'd like to see the city, if you don't mind. Maybe look up some friends in the diplomatic service. Don't worry. The family won't bother us, and no one else suspects. Living with these creatures for five years earns some credibility. That's either quite a disguise, or your Voss yourself. Our employers surgically altered me to look like the real Baston. The only way to infiltrate a closed society. I got to know my family, raise children, kiss my wife. I don't care how exotic they look, their breath always smells like Minoc dung. It's some spice in the blasted food. I'm operating on limited information. Why am I here? My orders were to find you a lead on Albathias. A human who showed up a few years ago. Voss called him the Shining Man. Where he came from is a mystery. But it only took him five weeks to go from outsider to practically Voss. Went through a dozen rites to earn their respect. Knew their culture inside and out. Knew their politics. Textbook infiltration. Impossibly perfect. You're talking past tense. What happened to him? Just when it seems the Voss can't love him anymore. He dies in his sleep, buried with honors, mourned like one of them. No one's touched the case much since. 
So if you want to learn what the Shining Man was up to, you've got a nasty job. Start with the tomb. What does died peacefully mean? It means he went to his home in Vos Car one night and didn't wake up. Heart condition, they said. Tombs at the base of the mountain, holiest place anon Vos can be interred. Predators keep the area clear these days. If you want to go in as a pilgrim, I've left clothes and instructions at a dead drop. Give me a call once you're in. Third Tun returns at sunset. Our family must prepare a welcome. We will speak again. Please select an available travel route.
outfit, part of the pilgrim's ritual to the Shining Man's tomb. Best way to avoid drawing unwanted attention. Tradition says the pilgrim's supposed to collect ceremonial offerings from the Seeker's path. That'll be your first stop. Then the tomb itself. Just watch out for the subhumans. The Voss call them Gornak, but all you need to know is that they're vermin with blasters. Fight for the next.
hunter begins. Increasing combat pheromone. We toured the tombs of Pengalan, but they were nothing like this, and all built for a lie. A conspirator. Bastan, I'm in position. Nothing in the sarcophagus but dust and a scroll. Dust? No way the body decayed that fast on its own. Send me a high-res image and bring the scroll back. Dust sample, too. We'll see what analysis turns up. What do you think this stuff is worth on the off-world markets? I try not to wonder. I'm not leaving the family anytime soon. Baston, out. Turn, father, your friend. Come share our meal. My brother Therid Tun is with us. We celebrate. You could tell me of your time on Vos. Thank you. Dinner sounds lovely. Come meet Therid Tun and my son.
Vamoye allows me to work in the alien enclave, outsider faces, outsider materials. You will never be an artist. But it is right. Your people bring vast opportunities. Be proud of your role. We have a lot to offer this planet and a lot to learn from you. Many outsiders say this. The three are patient. They will see. Father's friends introduced outsider goods. Is that how you met? It's not exactly secret, but it'll have to wait. Maybe dinner tomorrow? We have spoken enough. Our guest grows tired. Your company is welcome. I appreciate you putting up with that. Let's get to work. I'll send the ashes for analysis, but I'm more interested in the scroll. It's sort of an epitaph. Calls the Shining Man a man of prophecy, who was made whole in the wellspring of the Shrine of Healing. Something not sit right with you. The mystics have a whole library of prophecies. The rest of the Voss revere the mystics because their prophecies are always right. If the mystics prophesied the Shining Man's arrival, it would explain why the Voss accepted him so easily. It's awfully convenient, though. Convenient is one word for it. Any chance a prophecy was manipulated? Always that chance. About the second part of the scroll, though. Made whole in the wellspring of the shrine. The shrine of healing is a mystic sanctuary where people go to be cured. The sick and dying, or the spiritually wounded. Only a handful of pilgrims manage to complete the trek each year. I'd guess if the Shining Man was there, it wasn't for spiritual reasons. I need to find out what the Shining Man was up to. There's a pilgrimage camp not too far from Voskar. One of the guides there can help you reach the shrine and the wellspring. My advice, if you'll take it, play by the mystic's rules. It's not wise to defy the order of things. Take it slowly. prices this side of the galaxy. You check. Appreciate your business.
Welcome. Welcome. Please select an available travel route. Have a safe and pleasant stay.